Hi kids, this is Toy Testers channel. My sister and I will be showing you a new toy. We'll be testing here a new plaster toy for you. Let's have a look at the back side of the box. Here are the pictures and instructions how to mold a plaster into a dolphin. Let's have a look what we have inside the pack. This is dry powder and uh, we have a set of paints different colors obviously and we have a plastic uh, mold shape let's see what we have and another pack of dry plastic powder and um, a brush for painting obviously we'll be painting this later today let's put them aside and um, let's have a look at the instructions paper and uh, instructions paper says that we are gonna need a glass of water we're gonna mix the dry powder into the water and make the plaster so let's do it we're gonna mix it now let's open it with the help of the scissors but make sure you're careful or better if you ask your parent to do it for you we're gonna mix it now with the water um, dosage instructions are saying that it's gonna be like uh, half empty glass and we're gonna see what will happen we're gonna see what kind of plaster we will make we're gonna need a spoon to stir it let's pour some more pour some more Kate yeah It's gonna steer it and yep yep it's ready plaster is ready we're gonna steer it until it becomes really good so now we're gonna uh, cut the back side of the box we're gonna place a shape into it Now my sister Kate is gonna pour the plaster into the shape. We have to be accurate, we have to be careful. Make sure you feel all the hollow when you do it. All right, uh, let's just Clean the surface. It will require approximately three hours to get dry. Yeah, pour some more. Yeah, I think we're done. A bit more. Yeah, that's it. And we're back guys let's see what we have now I'm gonna show you what what we have here is dry dolphin dry gypsum dolphin mm, now I'm gonna paint the dolphin for you um, so as I told you uh, we have a set of paints um, we have also the extra extra containers as you can see here and and one container is for mixing the colors into it if we have some different ideas some different color we may need so now I'm gonna take off the gypsum Do it really carefully 
Let's let's see what happens. Let's clean the area first. And start from this side better, I think. Come on. Oh, yes. Here we are. Here we are, guys. We have a ready dolphin here. It's done. Now we're gonna paint it. So let's let's clean it first. And I think I think um, a piece of paperboard uh, will help to avoid staining the table. Let's use it and do it like this. And now I'm gonna start painting. Alright, um, I'm gonna start with C, and the C and the waves should obviously be blue. Um, I'm gonna require a piece of paper to try the colors first on the paper. So let's see, let's see what, what kind of blue we'll have on the paper here. Alright. I'm gonna check it if it is light blue or dark blue. I, I think it's fine, so I'm gonna start it. So I think I'm done with the with the um, background. So I'm gonna put some white lines on the background to make it more realistic, more realistic waves like this. Just just try to do the white lines. It's easy, it's simple as that. Yeah, that's all I think. Uh, that's all. And um, now I'm gonna mix uh, blue and white to make it light blue, really light blue for the dolphin. Because the dolphin is going to be like light blue uh, or gray, something like that.
content really accurately and carefully. Make sure you cover all the parts of Dolphin, all the narrow parts. I'm gonna do eyes. Um, so, kids, I'm gonna do eyes with black. I'm gonna clean the brush, and, and the paper will help here. I'm gonna use black paint for eyes. But you can also use dark blue instead. Um, here we are. Another eye here. And yes, we're done, I think. It will also require a couple of hours to get dry entirely. And here's the statue we've molded and painted for you kids. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. We're gonna test lots of other kinds of dyes together, kids. So, bye bye.